Hello everyone, man. Throw here and welcome to the quest guide for Violet is Blue. Now, this is a brand new quest, so probably going to be a little bit of skipping around, but there is no requirements other than one thing, which is you have to have completed Violet is Blue. So in order to do Violet is Blue 2, you have to do Violet is Blue. But anyway, you want to teleport to the Taverly Load Zone. It's probably your fastest way to get about it to it. You don't need anything else, so don't worry. Uh, the fact that I have stuff on me is not really important. But we got to talk to Posty Pete up here. Two days until Crit. Well, it's a little bit more than two days here, Petey. <laughs> so. I do apologize if there's any lag issues, um, for whatever reason, RuneScape is just behaving horribly today through Steam, whatever. Uh, I'm sure some people have noticed this being more and more of an issue of late, uh, sadly. So, problem with the land of snow. There's no letters coming through, so something is gone awry. Uh, there's no combat. Difficulty is novice. The length is supposed to be medium. Uh, the rewards for his follow. If you don't want any of the rewards, just go like this. But the rewards are one quest point, lamps of joy, wonder, and laughter, fairy light necklace, and fairy light whip, and two treasure hunter keys. And we are going to accept this quest. So I had a little bit of technical difficulties, like I said, uh, so it's gonna be a little bit of jumping around. <coughs> Not sure what is exactly going on, but now if you start the quest, if you go to go into it, you do have a choice of going back to Yeti Town or doing Violet is Blue too. So of course you want to select Violet is Blue too. So we're through. Let's talk to Posty. All right, you say you're busy, but what's up? All right, I remember Magnus, the snow wimp. Oh boy. So the letters were for me, apparently. Ooh, in a cutscene. <clears throat> I don't know if there's supposed to be dialogue. This is actually kind of cute. Pretty sure this is supposed to be Violet. And that's her dad. Okay, so we're supposed to keep an eye out for Magnus. Got a feeling I gotta go this way at some point, but we're gonna go up this hill. Can I surge in here? No, I cannot surge, because the hole's going into a cutscene. Buckaroo carrots? That's different than the last time, there's no more yellow snow. I can't, oh, I can't inspect the well anymore. Uh, 
Oh, well, there she is. There's good old Violet. Maybe it's Santa. Kind of heartwarming. <laughs> All right, there's what? What was the husband's name? I want to say it was oh, it was Trevor. I wanted to say it was Tom for some reason. Six and a half. Ah, uh, when they think they're the grown up at that point. We were all like that at one point. Alright, let's go see her. There's a cow. A lot of animals. Uh, it's good to see they use their uh, player own farm <laughs> textures for all of this. A panda bear. And a My Little Pony. of a tree for a kid. Yeah, we, uh, us RS players, we cut down a lot of trees, but I guess we never really leave them intact. So we got to play with her. So she's going to give me a clue and then I got to figure it out. In a dusty chest. Well, wouldn't that be the toy box? It says... It's definitely not the rug, obviously. Ah, there it is. Chest. Oh boy, we have that. Uh, there we go. <laughs> Sitting under a big. <laughs> I had to check Gunner Trevor. I want to say... Oh, I mean, the fireplace is pretty big. Okay, so it's not that. Uh, it has to be the rug then. Well, that's the fireplace. <laughs> fireplace is hot. The last clue is smelly. Is there a porta potty? Uh, 
Ah, barrel fish. That would have to be it. Who is the snowman king? <laughs> All right, Let, let's let's have some fun with this. All right. All right. So she's doing something. She's giggling. I'll keep my eyes closed. Uh, they're actually talking. Goodness. <clears throat> it's actually an imp. Snow imps. All right, so now we got no imps here. Yeah, let's see if we can't find Magnus. About the missing snow imp. His name is Magnus. Okay, they sort of know where he is. Oh no. So Magnus was playing hide and seek, or hide and peek, and now <coughs> he's gone missing. So let's go find Magnus. Searched well. <laughs> I mean, I can search her. Why not? <clears throat> so, let's search the crate. Let's search over here. Hey, we found Magnus. It's Magnus. Magnus Claus, the snow wimp. He was hiding in the chest. So, uh, can imps teleport?
Okay, at least you got out before Christmas. Alright. So he's got to do decorating before Christmas. Uh-oh. <coughs> so, we got to go to Yeti Town because there was some sort of explo- Ocean. Why would they light the tree on fire? So now we have arguing between imps and yetis. All right, violent. I see an imp floating around. <coughs> <laughs> All right, so it's up to me, Magnus, and Violet, or you, Magnus and Violet, to restore Yeti Town to the glory of what it usually is. All right. Okay, how can we help out? So we gotta convince Taylor to help us out. And then let's well, let's just talk to this guy here too. We'll talk to. I I just realized there was another snow. All right, so we got to visit. Well, let's try talking to this guy first. Well, too. Uh, we'll just get Timothy. Okay, so first we have to go and visit because we have to do this. Okay, so we got to go north pass. Ugh. We gotta go north. Uh, it's looking like the tree farm will be this way because, well, there's all the trees. Okay, there is Taylor. All right. Christmas tree farm. <laughs> well, we're used to trees just going poop. Okay.
So I want this one right here. The other ones are kind of like droopy. But that's the shortest one. Uh. So she wants the one that's kind of different for a tree. All right. That's honestly not what I was expecting. So we got to help the three different assistants. So basically we got to get we got to decorate the town. Okay, we got to talk to Brad here. It looks like a Grinch tree. So now we need to start decorating. So we're going to go to Susie. Okay. So now we're going to get Christmas decorations. They're all gone because they all got burnt. So... We got to go around and knock on the doors of the citizens or talk to citizens to get decorations. All right, well, there's a house. Let's just go. Oh, I guess I want to go clown or clockwise because I went south and then east. <clears throat> there's got to be a door. Huh? Ah, there is a little Yeti out front. Why does everybody look like they're up to no good? There we go. Here's a house I can knock on the door. Knock, knock. Anyone home? Alright, so there's one. Let's talk to this kid. Why do the kids look like they're up to no good? That's very uh, disturbing. Knock, knock. <laughs> Violet is blue. Aw, that's actually kind of cute. So all these kids are going to be up to no good. I, guess I figured that out now, which is kind of discouraging because I want to do all this work prior to have all those kids take care, uh, take it all. All right. So we got to get one more set of decorations and it's I, I want to say it's probably it's got to be this house down here because that is all that is left is this house here all right
Well, it's not this house, so we're gonna have to go west. Knock. Well, well, yeah. Let's just go west here. Come on, knock on our door. Okay. Oh. Oh wait, I don't think I got this house here, right here. Yep. Pop it. So now we'll go back up here to... Why can I insult the tree? Big blue and round, just like her dad. Alright. Add decorations to houses, lampposts, and... Okay. So now I gotta decorate. So everywhere we can basically click is what we got to do. Actually does look a lot better though. <laughs> if I'm going to be honest here. It looks like basically we just got to go back through and decorate everything we already decorated. So we gotta go. Oh, there's a door right here. So we got all the houses. There's just one post. There it is. Say so there's one light post. Oh my goodness. All right, let's go talk to Susie again. And we're on it. We should have one more assistant unless these kids do something. Help. What's wrong with Posty? All right, I guess I gotta go run to him. Help, what's wrong? Nicked what? Oh boy. So now we got to go around talking to all the kids and we got to find the list. All right, so he gave it to Peter. So now we gotta go find Peter. There's Peter. So I'm guessing, I bet you anything, it's this kid down here. I don't know, that kid's just suspicious down there. Mozzie. I know it was you, Mozzie. I had a feeling it's the kid down in the darkest area of the town. All 
All right, big house on the hill. I think he had a punzilla behind him. All right, there's Neil. So he tossed it out the window. Take Santa's naughty and nice list. At least it's right there. <clears throat> Aw. So she basically just wants everybody to be on the good list. Which, that is actually very sweet. Alright, talk to Posty. Hand over the list. <clears throat> How strange. Check back in with Magnus. Alright. And... Snow implings? Wait, what? Snow implings? To help decorate? Uh, how the snow impling? There's one right there, so. Why would I grab you? He yeah, has a very good point. <clears throat> well, I'm not here to catch you, there, little bugger, buddy. I was going to call him a bugger. Or buggy, I don't know. I was going to call him something with a B, that's for sure. Fly. Uh, all right, and launch them. Okay, we got to get to High Point Town. So I would assume right here is probably the high point in town. And launch! <laughs> okay, we just gotta keep throwing them from the same spot. Or <laughs> I actually feel bad for it. Alright, let's go back down and we'll talk to Magnus again. I'm thinking that's going to be it. That's actually kind of a cute tree. It's different. That actually is kind of cute. Yeah, that's, that's a pretty good way to go about it. 
All the imps are there, the yetis are coming out. This, this has been a good quest. Good heartwarming quest. Do make sure whenever you do this quest yourself to actually go through and read the dialogue. Uh oh. Alright, Magnus. Glad we could help, Magnus. <laughs> and with Magnus saying Merry Christmas. Oh. Oh, they put up decorations. Oh God, no, she's gonna run into the door. Oh boy, this is actually really pretty. This is really nice. All right, knock on the door. Oh, again. Oh, door's open. <laughs> All right, Trevor. showed up and decorated the house. They even brought in a nice tree. socks and man is that true if I ever heard it it is true I, I the older you get the more you want socks and underwear but that's actually it guys this is a wonderful heartwarming quest you get three lamps you get the fairy light whip you also get the fairy light necklace and a quest point and two treasure hunter keys with a heartwarming story and Merry Christmas uh, from Jaggets. And for me to you guys, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, and enjoy your quest. So thank you guys so much for watching, and until next time, later guys.